Welcome to part two in our four-part series on industrial Ethernet performance. In part one, we explained how Profinet uses TCP IP for suitable functions and why the overhead of TCP IP makes it slow for time-critical applications. Here's an example. Let's say I want to send a data packet from node A down the wire through a switch and onto node B. It would take a certain amount of time to do so. But the time on the wire is only a small slice of the pie, and the time spent at each node packing and unpacking the data is the bulk of it. To get real-time performance, Profinet goes the obvious route and skips TCP and IP. Instead, data is directly sent to the application layer. So, data packets take the same amount of time every time, an effect we call determinism. This instead of some packets taking longer than others, an effect we call jitter. Most data in Profinet networks is transmitted using this method. Communication is quicker and more reliable. But why stop there? Learn how Profinet gets even faster in part three of our series.